what exactly is a client access license? A client access license can be seen as an access right. It says it in the name. You need this to be able to access certain server environments. You buy these client access licenses for yeah, the software that you have installed on the server environment that you are trying to access. So in right off the bat as a basis you probably need the windows server operating system and that windows server operating system needs a client access license if you have a database installed on top of that windows server that database that sql server database would probably need a client access license for any device or user that you have in your environment trying to access that database and if on top of that you have a different application running for instance exchange or maybe sharepoint uh, you would require a client access license to access that application on that server as well. So for all these different products, if you have them all installed on your server and you have users or devices accessing that server, you would need to buy the correct client access licenses. You need to assign a client access license once to then be able to access any and all servers. The calls are calls are available as in two flavors. The user call, which is assigned to a named user. It's not a concurrent thing. Microsoft doesn't know any concurrent licensing models at the moment. Or a device call, which you assign to a client device, which then becomes a licensed device. So the user or the device call yeah, are the two distinctions that you can make here. And basically the way to understand what would be better suited for you is if you, for instance, have a lot of devices, but lesser amount of users, a user call might make sense. But if you have a lot more users than you have devices, the opposite might be true. Basically user calls are a bit more expensive than device calls because a user call, according to Microsoft, holds more value because a user might usually have more than one device that they're using. So you're using your laptop computer, you're using your mobile device, you're using a tablet. You, With one user call, you could already access the server environments from any of those three devices that you might have. The client access licenses are usually functionality based. So if you buy an exchange client access license, you have two flavors, a standard and an enterprise client access license. The standard one holds basic functionality and the enterprise client access license will offer an additional set of features that you might require. You cannot just buy an enterprise client access license because these are always additive. If you have a requirement for the enterprise functionality, you would first need to buy the standard client access license and buy an add-on to that enterprise license in order to unlock all the functionality for those set of features.